what looks like a painted belt from a reptile is actually one of nature's strangest predators, the hammerhead worm. It grows a foot long, secretes pufferfish-level toxin, and can clone itself if you dare cut it in half. Brace yourself, this isn't your garden worm. Stick around, Twelve, because I'll show you the science behind its uncanny powers and share how to confront 1W6 safely. Hammerhead worms belong to the genus Bipalium, originally from Southeast Asia. They've hitched rides in plant shipments and quietly colonised gardens across the US, Canada and Europe for over a century. You'll know them by their broad, hammer-shaped head and long, flattened body, sometimes striped, often up to 15 inches long. But how does this slimy stranger hunt prey? The answer is disturbing. Hammerhead worms are carnivores and sometimes even cannibalistic. They hunt earthworms, snails and slugs with sticky mucus and a potent enzyme that dissolves tissue externally, then slurp up their prey like a macabre smoothie. Even more shocking, they produce tetrodotoxin, the same neurotoxin found in pufferfish, one of the few terrestrial invertebrates that can do this. It's not lethal to humans in small doses, but can cause skin irritation or harm pets if ingested. Watch closely, because what happens next defies common sense. Hammerhead worms are hermaphroditic and masters of cloning. Slice one in half and both pieces can regenerate into separate worms. That's not a warning, it's a guarantee. After heavy rains, they surface en masse, and that's when things go sideways. In 2025, heavy rains across Texas have triggered a spike in sightings, from Houston backyards to greenhouses nationwide. These worms thrive in humidity and emerge when it pours. Found one? Don't panic, but definitely don't handle it with bare hands. Here's how to safely get rid of a hammerhead worm. Wear gloves or use tweezers. Never cut it. You'll multiply your problem. Kill it by placing in a sealed bag with salt and vinegar or freezing it for 48 hours. Wash your hands and keep pets away. Report sightings to local invasive species groups or platforms like iNaturalist. Hammerhead worms are small, but their impact is huge. Stay alert, stay safe and let the worm know you're onto them. If you learned something shocking, subscribe for more creepy critter deep dives.